even hesitate. Keep hair sleek, even in 97% humidity, with fruit tea, sleek and shine, super fruit Moroccan argan oil, super sleek hair, no parabens. Garnier fruit tea, sleek and shine, super fruit, super hair, Garnier. To ban under control, then we'll uh, switch our main playback to YouTube. Um, so yeah, YouTube's being crazy again, but who cares? Um, we'll still do this. Um, quick recap of what's been going on here lately. We just, um, took out a corruption zone. Um, uh, we found out more about Project Zero Dawn. Um, we went up into the frozen wilds and uh, there was a group of people that was just killing people just absolutely killing people so um, uh, we'll get back to that quest once we get to be a higher level but the frozen wilds is no joke my friends no joke whatsoever so we'll come back around to that um, like I said um, so yeah we've got a lot done and uh we're actually narrowing down our playthrough um let's see the quest that we have is the looming shadow uh we got five which was uh with air attack and Orea. and um yeah, so I won't keep chit chatting much longer <laughs> we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna get to the game here um so Frontier Justice, that's where those three guys where those three criminals were. So, Looming Shadow. This is what we're gonna do now, and um, we'll get this going. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. Yep. And as usual, don't forget to choose your destiny, and you can find us all across social media avenues. Wherever your social media is, we are, except for maybe Snapchat. Snapchat's weird, <laughs> but all right. Um, and as always, if you have any couple of quest requests, let's try that five times fast. As always, quest request, quest request, quest request, quest request, quest request. Quest request, quest request. <laughs> um, feel free to drop them in the comments. Say hi to ho, hello to me. I'm friendly. I don't bite. I don't bite. Yeah. So. I always have fun messing around with you guys. I really do enjoy these streams. So, <laughs> yeah, that's why I do them. Cause I enjoy them and I enjoy chit chatting with all fun people on these streams. So, all right. Ah, Aloy. Preparations are underway on the rigid defenses of that spire. 
Word was sent to every corner of the Sundom. Our allies offered their steel. Some came for Meridian, others for Shards. But many came for you, by name. For me? Don't be so humble. The ridge will be the front line. That's where the city guard are holding? Yes, bolstered by some of the uh, irregulars I spoke of before. The Osaram cannons that thundered Meridian's walls in the Liberation will now defend us. You're welcome to tour the defenses. And the Spire. Erend and the Vanguard are there? Indeed. Uh, clashing breastplates together and testing out their battle cries, I suppose. A number of the Nora have also arrived at the Spire. They have resisted the offer of a royal audience. Perhaps you could parley with them. I will. I suppose all we can do is wait for the attack. Exactly. It's not a feeling I cherish, but our spotters at Evening Sign report there's still no movement in the West. So, if there's more you need to do elsewhere, seize this time to do it. Otherwise, I've made the apartment of Olin Delverson available to you. You can sleep there, if sleep comes. All right, so I say we go check out our defense sites. Ooh, and we got another journal. Uh, as usual, I, I always say on a stream, if you need to go back and read these, then feel free, because I read kind of quickly. like these insights that we get and as you can see we've almost got all of our text data points we've almost got all of the holograms and audio data points so we've collected a lot of things along the way um, these these text data points in the world are a little bit more sparse and in between but we've got the main stuff uh, machines so we got a whole bunch and um, there's plenty more to collect in the frozen wild as you can see because that's DLC and uh, so hologram data points um, let's see oh in our notebook I also wanted to show you um, our machine catalog so we've almost got all the machines in the frozen wilds except for that one um, we got to figure out what this uh, demonic mess is still. Um, so yeah, we're winding down, and um, you know, um, if you guys have any specific games that you'd like to play after this one, let me know, and we'll try and make that happen in some way, shape, or form. Um, oh, we got another journal. Um, but yeah, my next goal is probably going to be Patapon. Um, I love Patapon. <laughs> always have and always will. If you don't know what that is, it's singing eyeballs. And it's hilarious and it's cute. So, here's our next. Next, uh, just got here. Go. So back, so back. Hmm. I thought I saw another one. Okay. Alright, it's cool. Uh Could you spare a moment to speak of the fire thing? Alright. So we got a lot of cool stuff going on. Oh, and on the YouTube side, it won't be a live playthrough, but we will have that recorded Jones for you guys. Feels empty. Should I sleep? Did I leave anything unfinished? 
Let's wait on that. Alright. So we are going to go preparations at the ridge. <laughs> like this has always confused me I don't know about you guys but it's always confused me keep running around like this I don't think I could get down here this way so let's fast travel you know guys if you've been watching me for any amount of time you know that I don't like fast traveling before we really get into the game but it's really weird getting around the kingdom so you know and in the meantime oh our low screen was quicker than I thought it was gonna be all right um, also on uh, my stream partners channel uh, don't forget to check out the uh, uh, my stream partners channel my stream partners channel on my stream partners channel um, so that's also select screen um, that's 5 e l e c t 5 c r e e n and you can <coughs> oh man you can visit us on patreon uh, forward slash select screen and player dot me forward slash select screen hashtag tip man <laughs> get back into the swing of things Can forgive me polish that armor who's it of course isn't that a little what nothing out with it woman forget I said anything you look very dignified thank you and shiny very shiny <laughs> This is funny. Aloy, I told you I'd be here. You did, Teb. But have your wounds even had time to heal? Honestly, if I fought, I'd probably come undone. But don't worry. I'll leave that to the other Nor at the Spire. I brought supplies instead. These Karja have made me an honorary quartermaster, whatever that means. <laughs> it sounds impressive. I could get used to it. We'll be setting up caches of arms and medicine under these banners. Look for them when the fighting starts. Aloy, when you went into the mountain, did the goddess tell you our chances? She didn't need to. I know we can do this, Teb. Maybe we can. Let me make that bigger real quick. Uh... Don't ask me where to go if you're lost. I'm a guard, not the town cry. There we go. Let's grab this real quick. Um, I don't like that theater mode, so let me fix that real quick. Just to make sure you guys get the full extent of what we're doing. Alright, I'll fix the edges later. <laughs> Is incredible. All right. Okay. So we already read that one. Alrighty. So we talked to Teb and what's in the supply crate. All this stuff. Cool. See what they got going on here. Little huntress, you called, so here I am. Ready to fight? Fight? I thought you just wanted tea and conversation. Is there a battle coming? I wasn't informed. Well, that can't be true. You're always informed. 
Ah, so I am. We've only met a few times, and yet you know me so well. I don't think I know you at all. But I'd like to. Hmm. When I hear that line, it usually means something else. Can I tell you a secret? Of course. I've been waiting for this fight my whole life. The enemy we face today is the same that turned Meridian into a slate pit and Sunfall into a bloodbath. Fanatics who torture and murder mothers, fathers, families, children, and say it's the will of the sun. I hate them, Aloy. I've got the scars of their whips on my back to prove it. And today, we can get rid of them once and for all. I said I came for you, but that was only half the truth. I came for them. This time, they're not getting away. I'm with you, Vanasha. We'll fight them together. And I won't forget it, little Huntress. Tomorrow, may the sun rise on a better world. Aloy? Um, at ease, Uthid. Meridian will be glad to have you on its side. And I am too. The honor is mine. You saved my epitaph from being a fine soldier, but a fool of a man. I'm hoping you won't need any kind of epitaph just yet. As the sun wills. When you found me, I was trying to eke out a glorious death. But now, a glorious life seems more preferable. To watch Edelman play in the low gardens again. Still surrounded by a dozen guards, but... What you did, Aloy, it was done well. Although, I can't shake this road, Vinasha. She delights in goading me. Like brazen colors waved before a behemoth. Do you want me to ask her to stop? No. I accept it. Well then. Meridian shall stand and shadow shall fall. I swear it. Here's to that, Uthid. <laughs> there are no shadows under the new day <laughs> So you must be Aloy, then. I thought there'd be more of you. More of me. Thicker, I suppose. More of a gear wheel, less of a ringlet. Don't get me wrong, you're very well struck. Do all Osirim flirt at the most inopportune times? Inopportune? Battle hasn't even started yet. Petra Forge Woman, I hail from the Free Heap. I'll be heading back in the next dust storm. Murad asked me to check over the city arsenal first. Cannons have aged well, but I've cleared their throat so they can really roar. Can I try one? Everybody wants a turn. Have at it then. Yeah. Hold L2 and R2 to load ammo from a nearby bio. Release R2 to fire. No need to aim like a bow. Hmm. Hmm, cool. Cool. So we got that together. Check out the spire. 
friend you think you're killing the battle with it. As many as I have. So? I love you play by the rules and like that. It's so... What? <laughs> Those two make a weird <laughs> pair. <laughs> Not gonna look. Poor Prince Vitamin. He's just a child. <clears throat> Thank you for bringing him home. Prince Eataman is alive and well in Meridian. The Some kind of journal. I think. Mm. It keeps saying that there's repaired files and then it just doesn't even do anything. Carja and Shadow have been proven baseless traitors. You're the hunter from the Banuk Grove. I remember you also, Nora. The machines shook free of their slumber after you arrived. Raged and fought. Uh, well, that, that wasn't my fault. No, I'm thanking you. That night, I decided I would not go back to Banur. I would take my hunt into these lands. So many machines, even demons. Spidery, skittering, without the blue light in them. Dead things that must be killed again. Our enemies dug up an army of them. An army? Yes, that's why I came. Good. I'll wait. Okay, side note. I'm happy for her help, uh, but that's creepy. <laughs> and, um... We didn't get that the first time that I played through because we didn't have the DLC. But now with the DLC, the Banuk are in this. So that's kind of cool. I'm your hawk. Where else would I be? Defending Meridian with Avad? I leave that to the rest of the lodge. I will not stand aside while one of mine fights alone. Not again. Are you sure you... You're risking your life for all of us. You can't ask me to stand by and watch. Not when I have the power to change it. Then I won't ask you. It's settled. I will fight by your side. My only request... Name it. Leave the biggest machine for me. No promises. That's Hades. Good luck taking on Hades. Thought she was gonna say something like, come back alive. No, just leave the biggest machine for me. <laughs> it rises taller than the highest tree. War Chief Sona. War Chief, you, you seem uncomfortable. The Nora do not belong here. I do not belong here. I will fight the metal devil that threatens us all. But my place is in the sacred land. The wrongness here jags at me like an arrowhead. I'm sorry to put you through this. Do not be sorry. This will be ended. My spear, my word. Sona's always a delight. <laughs> she makes me laugh with just how weird she is. <laughs>
Greetings, Aloy. Don't. You don't need to bow. The anointed doesn't like it. She doesn't much like being called anointed, either. It means a lot to have you here, Varl. I gave my word. So, Meridian, what do you think? I've seen many new things since I first met you. I should thank you. Varl, what's wrong? You really want to know? All right. I'm in a foreign land, a tainted land, defending a faithless city that looks like nothing I've seen, from something I can't imagine. And you, after all that's happened, all you've done, I feel like I should drop to my knees and worship you, but I know you don't want that. Boy, things are pretty tough for you, huh? Thanks for telling the other Nora not to bow. It's the last thing I need. <laughs> don't be too hard on them. They only joined this fight because the anointed did it so. Is that why you came? No. I would have come just to see you one more time. And we must fight a metal devil because the goddess says, or because you say. I think the goddess and I are in agreement. We're both glad you're here. So am I. Hard to believe that Varl is Sona's son when he's so chill and she's so like, wah, <laughs> you know. But, um, like, I think if this, um, storyline focused more on, like, the romance aspect, Varl could be, like, one of the potential dudes, like, you saw. I would just want to see you one more time, but <laughs> it doesn't. <laughs> And maybe Teb too. Oh, I'll make you a special armor for defending me from kids. <laughs> so who are these guys? They call themselves the Eclipse. What does that even mean? It's when the moon gets in front of the sun, idiot. Is that supposed to sound scary or something? I don't know. It used to be Karja. Karja are always yammering about sun and shade. Well, if they used to be Karja... How tough can they be? Yeah, they're best guys just like birds. We'll rip their little feathers off. And let's not get cocky, boys. Aloy. <laughs> so here we are again, gearing up for a fight. Only this time it sounds like the bad guys have a lot more firepower. What are we up against, really? I'm not sure. But there's going to be a lot of them, and they'll have machines. And if they get past us, it's not just Meridian that will fall. The rest of the world will go with it. That's... big. It sounds like our kind of fight. Right, guys? Well, where do they put the vanguard? At, At the, the front, front of the line! line! And why? Steel before iron! And what are we going to do? Hit them like a hammer till they can't hit back! back. Damn right! You hear that? Nobody's getting past the Vanguard. We're here for Meridian. And we're here for you. Thank you, Aaron. Ursa would be proud. Well, only if we win. There we go. Now we got a new one. All right. Yeah, so if you guys don't remember in one of our playthroughs, um, there was a hole that needed to be repaired 
and everybody was like arguing about who should go fix the hole who should go fix the hole it was bigger than they expected it to be and so while they're all arguing Elizabeth's like well guys uh, good talking to you thanks for all your help with uh, the project zero dawn but I've already gone outside and fixed the hole so to help mankind and um, it's like whoa so she's made like a really big sacrifice for everybody inside of you know the whole project and then um, what's his name Pharaoh Ted Pharaoh like gathered all the alphas like all this really smart minds together in one room and then he just let like the air into it and he killed everybody instantly and uh, knowledge uh, was destroyed in the process and it's a hot mess thanks to Ted Farrow almost single-handedly so it's a lot about fixing his mistakes let's see did we already talk oh, that's earned okay all right so we're gearing up for the final battle which um th this is you know the final battle uh, uh of the main game and then there's more to come afterwards so let's fast travel back up to the main part of meridian um so i really like how they set up this game um but you'll see uh, where there's just kind of like an overflow of the game and not uh, just some choppy parts that they just decided to throw in later on. They really blended it together well. So, um, yeah, it's exciting. This game is super exciting. And for this being my second playthrough and me still to be excited about it, uh, like it really says a lot towards the merit of the game, I think. Let's see. Is there something else that it add on? Nope. Alright. Cool. So I guess I just show it to you twice just in case you forget. For some reason. Alright, so let's see what our tools are looking like. Got a lot of blades. We got Terror Blaster. We need in these storm bolts. I need to get some more blaze. I'm always down for the blaze. And um, let's see. It looks like we need some more um, sparkers here. Alright, so let's talk to one of these merchants real quick. Let's see if he has what we actually need. Um, so we need... Sparkers. And we need blaze for days. Uh, yeah, you can never have enough blaze. So I think we'll go. Mm, we'll go with 100 blaze, just make it even. Echo shells. It said I had 72 echo shells. Was it the sparkers that we needed for the storm bolts? Yeah, we need those. I don't use this weapon a whole whole lot so we're just gonna get like 25 more just to supplement up oh, okay <laughs> I guess we'll get 30 of those just to supplement it but we don't really need it need it uh, we have our that we can traded for metal shards we just got our sparkle our sparker freeze potion resist fire 
can't buy our inventory is full. Alright, so let's go look into what we have for inventory. Special items, ammo, traps and potions. Yeah, so just be sure when you're going into this that you gear up everything. <laughs> uh, increase the size of your weapon satchel. We need rabbit bones. Outfit satchel. We need boar skin to get more resources. Moss. Blaster. Hunter proof of bow. Traps. Potions pouch. This would be a good thing to have, I think. Uh, rope caster, trip caster, forge fire, ice rail, terror blaster. Terror blaster. Y'all know me by now. I love my terror blaster, so we are definitely going to get that. Um, storm slinger. Yeah, I don't really care much for that. Just because the range on that is kind of meh. Let's see, what kind of traps can we upgrade? Our traps pouch? Yeah, might as well, I guess. I mean, I guess I don't use a whole lot of traps either. But, uh, that's cool. Let's see, resources. Now, I know we collected all those Banuk figures and stuff to trade and stuff, but I'm like, we spent all that time collecting all that mess. I'm not going to sell it. So that's just going to stay with us. Um, let's see. Our inventory. It said our inventory was full, but now we have like all that space, so I wonder if we could go back and trade with him to buy some more stuff like resist fire fast trap health potions let's get one of those alright I like those those are annoying because they're kind of like temporary, but I guess they help in the midst of battle. Uh, Terror Blaster Arrow Pack. Uh, corruption Arrows. I don't really use Corruption Arrows. Charge Pack. It's cool. Fire arrow pack. Okay, that's full. Okay, that's good. Alright. Like, see, we could go through here and sell a whole bunch of stuff if we really wanted to. Ridgewood. It was weird when I ran out of Ridgewood. I was like, I never ran out of Richwood before. So, metal vessels. I don't think we need all of these metal vessels, honestly. So we can get rid of those to make space, I guess. Metal burn. We got a lot of metal burn, too to clear up a little space just in case I find something else later on that would be valuable. And there we go. Okay. Final battle coming up here shortly because there's no other real quest Yeah, um, let's see, Frontier Justice, man, we just got, got, like, 
beefed in the head and like by those three guys and it was crazy and that's supposed to be a level 35 quest so the frozen wilds must be on like a whole other level and uh fire break so we completed the quest we need to the errands we need to except for the hunting grounds I didn't feel like they were necessary this go around really like you could get like little sun packs or whatever to help uh, what do they call them blazing sun boxes and stuff but yeah they were annoying oh and all these cauldrons for all the overrides hmm we could do more cauldrons before we go into this battle. Looks like we got all our corrupted zones and we got all of our tutorials except for the Storm Slinger one. But that was annoying and it really is not worth a whole lot. Shock machines weak to shock damage. And like stalkers and long legs. Now they tell us it's stalkers and long legs. We are trying to take down like uh, chargers and watchers with the storm slinger, and it was not doing any kind of justice because they just die. Um, <laughs> we could do these cauldrons. Let's check. Let's get this out of the way real quick. Like, let's see. Let's look at our map. Oops. <laughs> yeah, let's look at our map and then we just exit out of it. All right. So, filters. I want everything else off except for um, our settlements. That cauldron. Did we complete? We completed cauldron Zeta. I'm not sure if there's a cauldron up in the frozen wilds area. Probably gonna make you dizzy doing this. <laughs> um. So there's a cauldron there, and there's a cauldron there. Level 18, and we don't know what level that one is. We don't necessarily need the overrides, but they could yield like tangible rewards that might be good. Plus I'm procrastinating with this final battle because I'm like, oh my gosh, this is going to be crazy. Like you see how many allies we have, but... Alright, let's do this first. Let's go to the cauldrons. Ooh, this is gonna be crazy to do cauldron stuff right after we got all prepared and everything for um, this final battle, but eh, heck, why not? <laughs> I want to make sure you guys get all the content that we can possibly, so yeah. Um, in case you haven't seen one of my streams, I tend to go between an hour and 30 minutes and uh, three and a half hours just so you guys can get in and see what we're all about. Um, so it just depends on what we're looking at, how many battles we get into and how those battles go. So, you know, play it by ear, play it by ear with this. And of course we can always gear up again if same thing goes terribly wrong. <laughs> Which I hope it doesn't. Because a level 18 in comparison to a level 44. Hopefully we won't sink at it. But you saw that um, uh, uh, that uh, guy that we fought for the other cauldron. So, yeah. We fought the, um, 
Thunderjaw. I couldn't think of his name for a second. We fought the Thunderjaw, and that was a lower level. So that was an intense battle, too. So don't underestimate the, <clears throat> the power of a cauldron. But they really do help. See, 8,000 XP, one override, and a skill point. I'm going to look at our skills. We only need seven more. That could be beneficial. Especially when the cost of them is like three. So we need 21 more skills to purchase everything. So cauldrons. We're doing cauldrons tonight. Beautiful. Wasn't it? What are they doing here? I wasn't intending to do that, but I guess that's what we're gonna do. Uh, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven guys. Seven guys? Okay. This should be fun. <laughs> Away from home, far from the fight, and for what? I'm not here. It's like something just randomly blew up. Yeah. Oh, hello. He saw us when I was not looking. Okay. Both just need to sit down. Okay. Okay. Night comes. Ooh, dude. Ooh, my dude. Ooh, my dude. Let's see if he comes back. We're just gonna light him on fire. Lying in the pool. <laughs> Did that kill the boss? Ult is heavy. Yep, it looks like it killed the boss that easily. Cool, yo. That fire really, really made things easy. I'll just deal with this dunderhead right here. Kablamo. Kablamo. Player's container. I think we're good on that. So glad we didn't have to deal with that dude. Because <laughs> sometimes those, um, those like the heavy cultists and stuff are just so cheap and their weapons are just like way overpowered. Oh, we got an excavation key. Cool. Another excavation key. Another excavation key. I'm assuming they're all gonna have excavation keys just because um, they don't want you to have to take down a specific guy to get the key. I'm thinking. That's a wall. Let's bring our gun. Looks with me. I don't want that. <laughs> Maybe we have that either.
assuming that's not the only eclipse we have to deal with. And, uh, it's all right. Help me, brother! I knew it. What do I tell you about when they give you all this health? <laughs> you know you're gearing up for a big fight. It was a coincidence. But the wild got in. And now the enemy too. Rusted scrap. I don't know what I'm gonna do with rusted scrap. Guess we'll find out. There's one, two, three. Obviously, no hidey bushes. Whoa, to speak of. But there is blaze like that. We just did. Blaze canisters. Come on up there. Come on. They're not suspicious enough. Off you go. <laughs> It's only him. I'm not too worried about him. Don't mind me. That's a shame. Mm, that's slag shine. I don't really know what the purpose of slag shine is other than um, just trading it, but I've never had to. Just takes up room sometimes. Oh, I wonder if he's gonna come up here. Oh, can I jump from above? No, I'm too far. <laughs> Same with desert glass. Desert glass and slag shine don't to work. Me. Let's take her down. Wah! Boom! He didn't even have a chance. <laughs> Got too much already. There we go. The presence as a cauldron. Okay. Must have been a cave in. A big one. Okay. Hmm. There's five of them. down 
Is there hidey bushes? I don't see any hidey bushes. Right of hand. That's okay. Oh, there's six more. Okay, cool. I do enjoy lighting, lighting them on fire, as you can tell, because <laughs> they just explode. Let's see if I can work it over. Uh oh, that guy sees me. I think. But I'm You got anything better to do? Probably isn't. Yeah. Stay bright! Stay alert! Okay. I'm not really worried about these six, honestly. Let's see. If I have to, I'll run back that way, but I really, really doubt it. They're not that big of a deal, honestly. about what is like what we are going to have to fight in order to beat Come this cauldron now. than these guys Stupid. Yeah. Honestly, I don't think he can get up here and shoot arrows at me, but it's about the extent of the injuries. Oh, that was a total headshot. And they know it. It like took him back. He like totally like flew backwards. That was, that was like, yeah. Oh, this, there. That focus like throws off your accuracy, even though it slows it down. Oh, there's more than six. Imagine that. Okay. Yeah. 
there's actually a PlayStation trophy, like if you get a certain number of headshots. I don't know if you guys are collectors of trophies, but they're all. I just have to go on. Let's just do this. Get this out of here. <laughs> I'm not worried about them. I don't see any heavy guys. There's my hidey bushes anyway, so. Giving up. Won't you come my way? Come over here, you big dummy. Come over here so I can get you. Let's go. This is taking long enough, I think. Oh, he's got some kind of fire going on, though. In retreat for a second. Bow. Get in the back. Ah, hey, stop. Okay, there was a lot more than six. <laughs> I see them. There's six now. <laughs> Here's to pay. Got him over here. Probably gonna try to hang around and shoot something. Good boy. <laughs> Stay sharp. Somebody still see me? Where in the hidey bushes? Looks like a tall neck. It would be really right. cool no one here. if they just like let me try and override the tall neck instead of having to fight like another thunder jaw. I'm so tired of thunder jaws. Another excavation key? No, desert glass. <laughs> or desert glass. 
I don't know. If anyone else knows the like significance of desert glass, please let me know. Because I haven't seen any real use for it. I'd have to ditch something. something from my rappel point that I should have gotten at the time because I were here mm. Let's see. where did I come down from it's like a little box but I guess it doesn't matter it's not too important Ah, there it is. Just kidding. There it is. Ooh, a 22% tear coil. Let's take a look at our inventory. Quick like. Really? That's only worth two shards. Bleh. Okay. Got five of these keys uh let's see what we have in the way of modification what's our tear looking like mm, stealth weave corruption weave uh, oh we have a 42 percent tear coil we don't even need that one really Okay, well, I guess some people haven't got the rare tear coil yet, so they just given it to them. Uh, we got the health potion, so we probably got everything we need in that area. Blaze. I like Blaze. Oh, snap. I didn't even see him. There must be others oh, sniffing around still. But, like, he was, like, super late to a party. <laughs> like, all his buddies are, like, dead and gone, and he's just like, oh. <laughs> Do you hear that? Do you hear that sound? Go to the cauldron core. Just FYI, we haven't had a fall count this game. Woohoo! And we're an hour in. Yeah, get uh, yeah. <laughs> but I don't know, maybe I'm speaking prematurely, but um It's a good thing. It's a good thing. Cauldron core. We're going to the cauldron core. Ah. There's got to be something that we fight. There's more health. they did distinguish different cauldrons with different like little objectives but nah. it's typically a thunder jaw I think override the core let's see there's four or five guys roaming around right there Mm, 
six guys. That's the cauldron core right there. Legitimately, that's the cauldron core. There's nothing to fight? I gotta be beefing my bratwurst here. I don't know. There's something not right. There's always a thunder jaw or something to fight in these cauldrons. But I'm not remembering this one specifically. But there's no, like, it's not trapping us in here. Like the other ones have. I'm, like, really suspicious because I don't know why. Oh, he sees us. He sees us. I don't want him to see us yet. While well, we're still. Yeah, just go away. There's a heavy guy. There can't only be six of these dudes, can there? Really? Can there really only be six of these dudes roaming around like that? Okay. I guess we're gonna have to try and find out, but uh, where's the heavy dude? I, I want him out first. something weird there's something weird it's just I feel it guys I feel it and I don't know I don't know what to okay all right where's the heavy guy always oh, is he by blaze does he like walk near blaze that would be beautiful if he did See where's his track go? Oh, he just roams around the cauldron core. He knows what he's protecting. I didn't blow him up. Oh, jeez. Whoa, 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 whoa! No, 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 no. Alright, here we go. Just let that pass for a second. Maybe one will run down here like an idiot. Maybe. Alright. Let's just do this. Oh, there's a heavy. There he is. There's the heavy. Get him! Oh, get him! Get him! Get him! There we go. Ooh. Yes. Yes, we will. Back up. Will you? Just go away. Got him over here. There we go. Alrighty. It can't be this easy. And what they're so afraid of. I don't know what it is I'm afraid of. More machines I can override. Really? That's all? Why is there a timer? Somebody tell me why there's a timer! Ah! Stupid. 
way. <laughs> Unleash the what? A slew of machines. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That's what it was. <laughs> ah! Thirty-five. What's gonna happen in thirty seconds? No, no, bad boy, bad boy, bad boy. Take it off. Take it off. Exit. Yeah, they could all just fight it out. I'm peacing out. What is that? Those are stalker. Yeah. Rast always said, patience. Can I hippity hop over there? I'm assuming not. Let's see. What? What machine? What is? Um, what are stalkers? Afraid of shock, tear, 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 tear. I don't want to waste my tear on them. Where'd those dudes go, though? Guys, I don't think I've been to this cauldron before. I'm not remembering this at all. There's one. Can I just, can I just fast travel out of here? <laughs> of course. All right, let's go. Let's just piss these things off a little bit and get the heck out of here. Go already. It's gonna take forever to open. Ah. <laughs> Do I not have the override for stalkers yet? Is that what it's going to be? Yeah, this is going to be the cauldron to override the stalkers. Cool. Ah. Climb the pillar to escape. Okay. 
Let's kind of pillar to escape. All right, let's put down a waypoint. Just because those things are like all over the freaking place. Ah, get out. Let's go. Let's go. Go away. Go away. Go. Fight all these fools. We're just dipping. Stop. Bags, Glint Hawks, Fire Bell Bags, and Behemoths. Yes, we got some of the bigger boys. Ooh, we got more health, and yeah, we got another skill point. Woohoo! Yay, three. So, that really did help, and that really wasn't a bad cauldron. So, I am satisfied with that. Yeah, that's good. Let's see, I really just want to let them all take each other out. Before we do anything. <laughs> or can we just, like, not? Yeah, we can just, like, not. <laughs> Fast travel is disabled right now. Should give me an upper hand. 
that we don't need right now. <laughs> For rain. Me, not so much. And they took out a little bit of our health. So, probably have to collect some of that all along the way. That's okay. Got all my rocks. <laughs> yeah, our medicine pouch is full. Now can we fast travel to the other cauldron? Uh, yeah. All right. So that was a pretty cool cauldron. It wasn't really all that crazy as the other ones are having. I did not appreciate having to fight Thunder Jaws over and over again and then have to go fight Red Maul after that to be become Tawana's um like um mentee, I guess. <laughs> like I forget what they call him. She's the hawk, and then like we're like her fledgling or whatever underneath her. So I had to defeat Red Ma after fighting a cauldron thunder jaw. So that was fun. <laughs> There we go. All right, cool beans. Let's see what this cauldron has in store for us. Where's my hottie bushes? Cauldron row in the quest menu. So this has 6,000 XP. It's a level 11. So we're a level 45 now, so I'm not as daunted level 11 but never underestimate the level click <laughs> because that frozen wilds I'm telling you I'm telling you there were three you know, like murderer people and they were level 35 and they're no joke so 
Uh, let's see. Machine repair for our skills. Mount repair. Dismount strike. This one might be pretty cool. Ooh. Bam. Uh, call mount. Fighting back, heavy spear attacks deal increased damage. When Eloy's health is low, hopefully our health saves more arrows at a time. And it can be confusing to kind of notch the arrows when you're in a panic. <laughs> fast reload, fast reload when using concentration. So, maybe we will go with the triple shot. It's not required to use, but you can use it to deal more damage up front. So, that'll be what we do for now. Um, the rest of these seem kind of like, eh, maybe I need them, maybe I don't. So fighting back is probably the next one we're gonna choose. Yeah, yeah, I'm saying fighting back will probably be the next one we need to use, but hopefully we won't get to the low level of, t of health. And stuff like that. We'll keep going. Oh, and I also was going to check which machines we have not overridden to see what ones we will get. Okay, so that's for Sigma overrides. We already unlocked that. Wonder. We got Rock Breakers. We got Behemoths. Thunderjaws. Oh, Stormbirds? We got Stormbirds. I don't know who we're trying to override here. Ravagers. Oh, Snap Moths. Ravagers. Snap Moths and Ravagers, looks like. So, wonder if this is going to be by some kind of water feature of some sort. But I like how they distinguish that last cauldron from the other ones. I really do. There was a lot of, you know, the um, the shadow guys, but not bad overall. I like that one a whole lot better. What is that? Oh, it's just a water. Come on, baby. I'm afraid of you. You're cheap. You fight cheap. Take out all these fools. I always complain about watchers. <laughs> They're like the annoying cousin that nobody likes. 16% um, spear damage coil. We haven't had spear damage coil. Interesting. Spear damage coil. This correction we. That's 28% and 8%. Uh, resist melee, resist freeze, resist stealth. Um, this dude looks like. But 16% spear damage coil. I want that one, I think, because I don't. I haven't seen one like that. Crafting, carrying capacity, mods. Where's my mod satchel? Yes. Yes, cool, great. Now I can get this mod like I want it. 
Haven't seen that one. Um, maybe we can attach it to this spear. Modify weapons. There's only one that we can do that one. Shot coil. Yeah. <laughs> oh well, at least we upgraded our mods thing. Uh, what you got for me? Sparkers. These are helpful. Better though. Okay. This has to get tricky. through that pipe. Liquid. to look for a way in. What a waste. Hmm. Poor person. people. But like, what would somebody else want in a cauldron? They were curious too. But I'm better prepared. I hope it's enough. know what this means. <laughs> it's a level 11, but don't underestimate the level. Ever. There's probably just more health. They keep, you know, they keep feeding more and more health for people that don't have like the shield weaver armor or whatever. Yay! That was helpful. 
But unlike the last cauldron, we're going deep down into the depths of something. So it's probably going to be a monster and not people. Unfortunately. <laughs> But I don't know why I'm freaking out because we have our terror blaster. Need to find a way through that shell. I always feel bad <laughs> for, oh, these are, ra that's a Ravager, I don't feel as bad for Ravagers, even though they're pretty cool, but, <laughs> the Ravagers, see, like, if you go into the notebook, in the notebook, there's Stalkers, are probably my third favorite out of the cats, then you got like ravagers they're like second but then you go and you see the sawtooths the sawtooths are so pretty <laughs> so i always feel bad about the sawtooths because I, I really like them a lot they're hands down my favorite machine spear damage again but we don't really need it now we have the 16. all right so damage to that. This one should take me up. Up, up, up. So one of those, I'm assuming. Can we get weird for a second? Let's jump off. Let's see what lady. I'm examining the situation a little more. So at the top of that, we have to get on there. time. Uh oh. Let go, Eloy. Let go. <laughs> We're about to get into like zappy land. See, that would not have been pretty. Okay. So that guy goes that way. I 
think it's in the right direction. percent handling coil. We've already got better handling coils in this, but oh well. Might as well just grab it because our carrying capacity is good enough right now. Alright, that should get me through. That's where I just came through. Okay. And I'm Wait, I'm getting confused. Hold up. <laughs> back over there and do it. No, Aloy. Okay, about to get toasted on that one. So now where do we go?
Okay. That didn't work. something else. was supposed to stop that. Yeah, it did. Because they're kind of confused. And like triple notch, that's what we just bought with our skills. Let me show you how it works. Where's the other guy at? I'll do what I have to. He's coming for us now. Deeper into the depths we go. And there was a long leg, I think. There's another watcher. Hello, big boy. <laughs> I 
get up there, will I? Or we're like trapped in the water. Ooh, they didn't see me. Watchers are just annoying. <laughs> Concussion sack just yeah. Tear I'm not gonna waste all my tear on him. Looks like it's just another watcher. Yep. Okay. Uh, Alright, we'll take it all. I don't know what's in the middle. But evidently we're still good on health, so... I love this shield weaver armor. <laughs> so this is a blaze process in the center. Ah! 
<laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> Fast. Get up there, though. Hmm. where I need to go. What is waiting for us down there? 
discharge pylon. Is it going to discharge inside of it? A snap ma? A snap ma? Ha ha ha. I got two watchers over there and a snap ma. Okay. So snap maws throw ice. And of course, there's snap. little in comparison to the thunder draws. Keep the upper hand. But never underestimated. But, but this says it's a friendly machine. With the thunder jaws, they said they were friendly. <laughs> by like shooting its babies essentially because like it's it, like watchers like baby thunder jumps and it was mad <laughs> but handled it
<laughs> That's not what I meant to do. A shock trap. We could just tear blast the mess out of it. Get away from me. <laughs> Don't lose any hell, cool. Ravagers. Is this corruption? Okay. Yeah, we got blaze. Blaze, blaze. Yeah, we just rip those components right off. Them. Intrusions, forcing them to make aggressive machines. They used to be part of Gaia, but now, just like Hades, it 
It's on its own. Following its own agenda. But why this? What's it trying to accomplish? Another mystery to solve. But first, I'll need to deal with Hades. Cool, we got that one. And, um... We got all the machine data points. Inventory, we got plenty of new resources and all of that. And uh, Hephaestus. Okay. Um, let's see, are there any more cauldrons we need to look at? Ooh, those are a lot of campfires. Um, gotten most of them that I know about. I don't see any more. Let's look in our notebook. So now We've got Ravager, we've got Snap Moss. Seems like we got all of them. The Fire Bellow Bag, the Freeze Bellow Bags. Seems like we got all those overrides. We Oh, Epso Wilds one. So, that's probably going to be a pretty high level one. One we don't want to mess with right yet. Um, Frost Claws, Epsilon Overrides. Whatever that is, it still looks like a sloth or a badger or something. For that, you can't really do anything. And we already have the overrides for that. So, we have one more cauldron to override. But that's after the fact. We don't have to do that one now because we don't have to deal with frozen wild stuff yet. Yet. We have put a word in that. But all the normal... people is died trying to get these overrides. I guess what we could do now is um, the storm slinger. Where's my the storm singers up on top. Yeah. Okay. They say you have to fight stalkers and long legs in order to get that. Some machines. We can try and do this tutorial, I guess. But where are our stalkers and long legs at? Right here. Long legs, we got Glen Hogs. 
Sawtooth. We got stalkers. So that's where we want to go, actually, to get this tutorial. I know I said that tutorial was annoying and we don't need it. Technically, we don't need it, but I'm gonna. I guess I'll take care of that along the way. but I'm used to it. Yeah. I normally wouldn't have fours or whatever, but I think there was one that I needed for um, completing. Dang, dude. that tutorial did I yeah yeah see it didn't even give me what I needed for this one and I don't know why it's not working like it's properly supposed to do but I guess we'll try it with something else Something's running around over there. Can stop dancing up. Spidey bushes. I don't know how I did that the other two times and now it's just not working this time. stalkers which I never would go in the direction of a stalker unless I <laughs> had to do this quest I guess just stay out of their way for now If we don't get this after a couple times, I'm gonna forget it, but it might help a little bit. But we're trying to accomplish. I don't even see anything. Mm. 
This quest is like pointless because I don't know why the last one isn't working. So we are going to fast travel over here. Um, and I think. I think that we're gonna call this stream for tonight, maybe. And um, on our next stream, that's when. Um, on our next stream, that's when we'll go into the final battle. Just so we can focus solely on that and not all the other <laughs> overrides. So, I think this is a good point to stop. So while I save, um, I'd like to thank you all for tuning in with me today, um, and yeah, thank you all for tuning in, I really appreciate you. Um, we are on all different avenues, so you can find us on Twitch, Instagram, Facebook, um, and YouTube, although we aren't doing live streams on YouTube for a while because of um, YouTube's craziness. <laughs> um, you can still catch our videos on YouTube, but they just won't be live. Um, check us out on patreon.com forward slash select screen. That's 5 E L E C T 5 C R E E N. And also player.me forward slash select screen hashtag tip. If you feel so inclined to donate to our cause and help us continue to bring you guys great content, um, be sure to check out my streaming partners um, section of the channel as well. Um, again, it's just select screen and he's on Twitch and YouTube also. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this playthrough. And um, I will be back with you on, let's see, Thursday. I'll be back with you on Thursday. Um, we're trying to get a, a regulated schedule so you guys know exactly when we're going to stream. So I should be on Tuesdays and Thursdays from here on out. Alright, so once again, thank you for tuning in. Love y'all. And don't forget to choose your destiny. Elmo out. <laughs>